In this video I'm going to be sharing my everyday makeup routine and although I've not done one in almost a year, not that much has changed apart from the addition of a few new products. Skincare plays a huge part in the overall result of my makeup and I'm using the Origins Ginseng Day Cream. This really helps to hydrate and plump my skin so it's ready for makeup. If you've seen my previous skincare or beauty videos, you will recognize this product. It's the Origins Ginseng Refreshing Eye Cream and I'm so excited because it has just been re-released and reformulated and it's now available in two different tones. I'm using the shade Warm because I have a warmer complexion. This has been a holy grail in my skincare routine for years and years. It really helps to de-puff under the eyes, it really hydrates and it helps to counteract any darkness and it really brightens under the eyes. So immediately your eyes look brighter and more energized. Moving on to more skin prep, I'm using the Shoujo Armani Luminous Silk Hydrating Primer. This is going to help keep my makeup in place, but also give it a really nice boost of hydration. Since I've just come back from holiday, I have a bit of a tan, so my go-to foundation at the moment is the NARS Radiant Longwear Foundation in the colour Tahoe. I apply this with a flat top brush and just really push it into the skin. The more you push, the more natural it will look. For my under eyes, I'm using the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer in Ginger. I go a little bit lighter under my eyes just to really help brighten underneath. I'm buffing this in with a brush and it really helps to make it look more natural and more skin-like. Moving on to contour, I'm using the Milk Makeup Matte Bronzer and I'm applying this to the areas that I want to look more defined, so my cheekbones, around my temple and my forehead. And I push this into the skin, making sure I don't move it around too much, but just buff it in enough. As you can see, this is my go-to bronzer. It's the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Bronzer. And I like this one because it's really lightweight. Your skin still feels like skin after, but the color is really suitable for warm complexions. This is a new addition and it's the Rare Beauty Soft Pinch Liquid Blush in the colour Joy. This blush is so pigmented that even the amount I put on here is too much. So I really work this into the skin and it leaves the most beautiful glowy sheen and the colour is just amazing. It really helps to brighten my whole face. I'm filling in my brows using the Benefit Goof Proof Brow Pencil. This is my go-to because it's really easy and quick to use. And I just follow the natural shape of my brows and I just blend it in with the spoolie so it looks more natural. For a little bit of definition on the eyes, I'm going back with the Charlotte Tilbury bronzer and I'm just going to apply this onto my crease. This is really quick to do but it always makes me feel a little bit more put together. To line my eyes, I'm using the Urban Decay 24-7 Eye Pencil in Whiskey and I just create a winged liner. This is really soft and really subtle but I love that it gives my eye definition and it helps to elongate the shape of my eyes and make it look more feline. Curling lashes make such a big difference in making my eyes feel more awake and open. I'm using the L'Oreal Air Volume Mega Mascara and this gives my eyelashes so much volume. I absolutely love it and it stays in place all day. And my favourite lip combo that I just can't seem to shake, it's the Natural Collection Lip Pencil in Espresso and I'm using this to outline my lips and then I will go ahead and fill in the rest of my lips using MAC Lip Pencil in Spice. I love this tone because it feels really natural and really warm. And to top it off, I'm using this beautiful Givenchy Sheer Velvet Lipstick in Beige Nude. This colour is so gorgeous and it gives a nice matte sheen, but it's also very comfortable. And that's my makeup look complete. It's really quick and easy. Normally it'll take me about 15 minutes max to do this look. And I really like how radiant and glowy the whole makeup look is. It makes me feel more put together and polished. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one.